This is Vat19. We're known for using our curiously awesome GIFs to make awesomely big videos. Each week our team has to figure out how to pull off a new idea and try to create the next hit. This could be awesome. This week I've challenged our team to use the tipster to create a drink waterfall that'll run all the way from the roof of our building down to our parking lot. So this is the tipster. It's a pretty clever product. It comes in three separate parts that fit together really easily to make a sloped holder for your party cups so you can have a cascading waterfall of your favorite beverage. It's a fun accessory at parties and it comes in a mesh bag so you can take it to your next gathering. They're designed so you can fit together multiple sets, but we gotta figure out how many we can do. So what Jamie has challenged us to do mm -hmm. is to try to make a waterfall of beer from the roof to the ground. How tall is that roof? 20 feet? We're gonna need at least 50, if, least. if not yeah, more. I'm so. really worried this is gonna either slip or collapse under the pressure. Yeah, under the weight of all that beer. We're gonna need gonna... something to support it. You can't just kind of like lean it against the building too because upward pressure on mm. it's gonna help it yeah. So we need some sort of suspension. I'm thinking some kind of wire or cable system. If we do some math, we can measure how high the roof is, how high the hypotenuse of beer will be, and then we can figure out how many of these devices we're gonna actually need, how many sets we're gonna need. Oh, and, and last but not least, we gotta get a keg of some sort on the oh, roof. That's the best mm. part. Yeah. Pouring water and seeing how far we can go. Is it heavy yet? It's all right. Oh yeah, now I'm feeling it, because it's getting that. Leverage. Getting hydrated? Getting real hydrated. I think what we're gonna have to do is get something to clamp the first one and then we can kind of just see how many we can get on there. There's a curve to it now. I know. Oh! Kira! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Alright. I think we know the limit. It's, it's I 12. Even, I didn't even have them all filled. It's, it's less 12. than 12. It broke after just a few, so we definitely need some sort of support system. While the other guys are outside working on the tipster video, myself and Nina, our social media manager, will be cranking out a bunch of photos for Instagram. This is rose cotton candy, am I correct? Yeah. I'm looking for an image to download to have as our projector background, because we want to set up a like nice little winery scene for this photo for Instagram. All right, what are we doing first? For this, I was thinking, if we want to try to make our own Bud Light Lime, uh -huh. the beer in the top put okay. just like a shot of lime, okay. so it kind of like mixes in, uh -huh. and then maybe by the third one, they're like mm. mixed. Go, John. Oh, go, yeah, John. John. Go. He's getting that How lime. I got it. Right towards the end, I got <laughs> it. Is it good? It, it was taste? really good. I'm going to go tea, lemonade, and then orange juice. Oh, it's going. Mm. How is it? I get a little bit of all three flavors. It's pretty great. Let's make a mimosa. Oh, I get a pop one of these. I, oh I my know god, I this want you is to pop the best. That. The Jenny camera, back. don't back up. Everyone has left. Is it even doing? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's over there. You are terrifying. We probably should do juice and champagne in the back. This will be a good one. And mm. is that good? Does that feel like brunch on a Sunday morning at your favorite restaurant? It does. Brunch, 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 brunch. So we're gonna run to the hardware store and see if we can't find the materials to make our beer fall. Hey, are you in the office? Do you know that, draw is that drawing still on the whiteboard of our plan? How many feet did it say the hypotenuse was? Okay, perfect, 31 feet, all right, cool, thanks. Two of these should work great. Now we just gotta get some bolts to go through the thing, some concrete. Got one more task for you. Can you run to the roof and measure how thick that like lip on the roof is? John says it's approximately six and a half to 6.75 inches. This is an eight inch clamp. That should work. So we gotta measure these posts to get them the right distance apart so that the wires we run up to the roof sit at the right distance. And then our tipster can ride on those cables. So we're clamping up some wires to run down to our barrel of concrete. So the two wires will be the track that we set all the tipsters on. Kara, do you believe in us? I want to believe in you. 
That's not the same as believing in me. It's about 10.45 a.m. Kind of curious to see how long this will take. The goal is just get the beer down the waterfall. I think we can do it. This is something they teach you in film school, by the way. And my untested, unproven, just kind of winging it calculations, <laughs> I think it's gonna work. I'm not really doing anything. Got it? Got it. Now you're just both tightening? Yep. And this is what's gonna hold the weight? Apparently, that's what's gonna hold it. Uh, We're gonna have to like zip tie this one to the wire too so it all doesn't come sliding down. Yeah. Danny is getting his monthly workout in. Good thing we have this, uh, we have 900 pounds of sand laying around, huh? Yeah. I do think that would work. So I think we should just load it all up and then fill it with water, see how it flows, and then if it's filling out the sides, then we can adjust accordingly. It's like one wrong move, the whole thing is gonna crumble apart. It's all on Joey now. What? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh my thing. gosh! Mm, it's twisting. Yeah, if this doesn't work, we really don't have another plan, guys. If this doesn't work, we've got a keg and a boss who's not here. We're almost there. This has some serious weight at this point. I can't imagine how much it's gonna weigh when we had the beer. We've got a truck coming in to the warehouse. It's gonna barely get by us here in the parking lot. Oh, this makes me nervous, Adam. Yeah, it's good. I asked him if he needed help, and he's like, nah, I got it. Here we go. Oh, that whole thing shakes. One tiny shake turns into like a big rumble. I don't like heights, so we gotta get this done quick. <laughs> okay, go a little to your right. <laughs> okay, I got like six cups in. All right, now I get right. on Joey's yeah, Danny, shoulder. get on. Yeah. You're a lot hairier than Kara. Yeah, I'm also mostly legs, so this isn't gonna get us very far. <laughs> Good job. All right, that's as far we as we got. Three. All right. I think there's a better way. I think it's been right here the whole time. Hey, did I ever tell you guys I'm extremely afraid of heights? We have 88 cups that hold 16 ounces. That's 1,408 ounces of beer to fill every cup. Let's just go for it. With the beer? With the beer. Or with water? With the beer. I think we should go for it too. I think we should just go slow and start at the top. I, God, I don't like this. <laughs> oh gosh, I don't want to watch. Go! Moment of truth. Oh, I'm afraid those cups are gonna just crash down. <gasps> it's doing it. It's coming. It's doing it. I just see a small white foam stream. It doesn't look like it's falling apart but we've only got like seven cups so far. It's working! Should have rigged something up oh, no. and pulled this. Oh no. Oh, we can save it. We need more cups. We need a bucket. What if we lose all the beer before it makes it down here? That is a lot of leakage. The wire's bending. It's making it harder for this thing to spill over. So we're just gonna pump as fast as we can. We're hoping we can at least get it down here before the keg empties. I think we're losing too much. Not feeling good about this. Bring me my beer! Yeah, that made a big difference. Him pulling on it. Could stay here all day. We've run into a little bit of a problem with the dip in the middle. I think while we're trying to fix that, the whole thing's gonna fall down. Oh, I can hear it like creaking, the cups. That actually helped. Did yeah, it? that's helping. You should try it again. Give it a whirl. Trying it again. Whoa, it's flowing fast. Cup. New cup! The keg's feeling a little light. Are you serious? We're gonna make it. We're like halfway now. It's going fast now. Oh God! New cup! What happened? I don't know. Get a pull on me! <laughs> it totally helped when you did that. I hope this doesn't go oh, on the so internet. Cool. This is definitely going on the internet. Kara, that's the whole reason. It's picking up pace. Uh-oh. <gasps> no! 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 There's nothing? We're tapped out! We're tapped out! So here's my thought. Every cup's full. I'll get down there. Kyle will pull. It'll, it'll beer fall. All right, here we go. Once the cameras are ready. I'm rolling. 
You getting it? Are you doing it? You getting it? Woo! Yeah! We did it. Was, was it, it refreshing, crisp? Danny? It was very crisp. We just drank beer off the roof. Roof beer. It worked. We did it. Remember, you can get your own tipster now at vat19.com for your own party fun. See you next time. Got it, cut. Let's go. Whoa. <sighs> Got those beer burps. It's real foamy. I'm like a garbage man. Bat 19.